Welcome to the Speak Your Success Podcast. What's going on, successors, and welcome to the Speak Your Success Podcast. I'm your host, Jonathan Jones, and today I want to drop another Monday motivation on you. Friends, first and foremost, if you have not taken a moment and subscribed to the Speak Your Success podcast, I want to encourage you to do that right now on whatever platform you listen to podcasts on. We would greatly appreciate that. And ultimately, you then will get all the updates, all the episodes as soon as they drop. Okay, so first and foremost, you want to do that. And now I want to just dive in. Michael Phelps, we're going right into the water. Today for Monday Motivation, I want to just put on your head, how are you personalizing your professional experience? That's right. How are you personalizing your professional experience? Because there are a lot of people that desire to be entrepreneurs. There are a lot of people that's in the professional space, in the professional arena, in corporate America, wherever it may be. But how are you separating yourself from everyone else? John, are you talking about comparing? No, we're not talking about comparing. We're ultimately talking about you just reinventing what you do, right? You positioning yourself to be in front of people wherever you may be, whatever industry you might be. Okay, here's here's a quick one. Here, here's just a really brief one um, that I like to do. After I have phone conversations with individuals, okay, after I have phone conversations with them, we, we call each other on the phone. After that conversation, I always see how I can remain connected with this individual. Maybe it's a thank you card. Maybe it's dropping them a little something in the mail. Maybe it's even just sending them a message throughout the week just to see how they're doing, just to see how they're holding up, just to check in on them to see how their family is. How are you personalizing your experience? Because you don't want people to always think that every time you call them, you're trying to get something. You don't want people to think that every time that you all have an exchange, it's always about what's in it for me. You want to serve your clientele. You want to serve your fan base. You want to serve the people that ultimately you're connected to. Here's another way. See how you can connect them to somebody else in your network. Right. Let's say that you're somebody who will say speaks because that's always my example. Right. And you know that they hired you to be a speaker. Now you talk with them two months later, you should be seeing what other type of speakers they're looking for so that you can help them get their need met. And by way of you helping them get your need met. That not only looks good upon you, but then you also have the opportunity to introduce somebody else into the situation. And then that makes that individual look good as well. So ultimately, we win together. So the first thing is uh, find a way to separate yourself from everybody else by personalizing the experience. The second thing is by connecting them to somebody else. And the third piece, we brought it back to you. That's right. Now see what else you can offer or how else you can serve somebody else without looking to leverage it, right? Like if you do a presentation, you do a great job. They say, John, you did an amazing job. Thank you for coming and hanging out with our group. Thank you for adding value to our group. John, is there anything else that you have to offer? Well, you say, yeah, of course there is. I, I would love to do a separate question and answer you know, peace. I would love to do a separate question and answer session just to make sure that I'm helping your group, just to make sure that they have all the resources and they have all the information that they need. My friends, in this time, servants are the ones who will be successful. I want you to remember that people who serve are the people that will be successful. That's it. I don't think anything else needs to be said. This was another episode of the Speak Your Success podcast. I'm your host, Jonathan Jones. And I just want to remind you, 
speak your success, believe in your greatness, and continue to create the life and business of your dreams. So why would you and should you live any other way? You shouldn't. Take care, my friends. See you all next week. Thank you.